television has spawned a variety of animal stars, but few are as intriguing as Panther, the telepathic tabby from early edition. He's been delivering tomorrow's newspaper today for four seasons now. The show's human star, Kyle Chandler, plays Gary Hobson, the reluctant recipient of the supernatural subscription supplied by Carl, the clairvoyant kitty. At the beginning of every show, Gary wakes up and he hears a thump and a meow. Gary goes to the door, opens the door, and there's the cat sitting on the paper. Animal trainer Bill Casey supervises Panther's paper delivery. Working with a cat on a film set like Early Edition um, is difficult because of the fact that they're very perceptive about their environment and everything going on around them. There's a lot of things going on around them on a film set. So consequently, it takes a lot of effort to keep them focused on their job. Bill and his assistant, Beth Casey, use Panther's kitty carrying case as a focus for his attention. In rehearsal, Panther is consistently rewarded with food for walking to his private trailer. That was good enough for now, Beth. I think what we should do is just let him, you know, relax a little bit and uh, so that he's got an appetite for working later on. When they're ready to shoot the scene, I'll take him out of the apartment space, place him on the paper, and tell him to sit. At that point, we allow him with the door open to see where the cage is, so he knows in advance where he's going to go to. Come in, camera left. Okay, I do one of those Kyle triple takes. Cat goes in, take the paper. We push in as he reads the paper. Yes. When I place Panther on the paper, I sit just out of camera range next to him, basically talking, reassuring him. Stay, stay, that a boy, stay, stay. Just as planned, Panther swaggers sharply on every take. His rare ability to concentrate has propelled this pick of the litter to primetime prominence. As the popularity of early edition grew, so did the responsibilities for Panther, the 14-year-old feline phenom. Rather than retire, he did what any four-legged superstar would. He hired some hungry young cats to share the load. Panther has a couple of stand-ins, partially because of his age and partially because of the variety of requirements with each script. Since we're going back to 1929, is there any way to make a camera? During today's shoot, the director needs Carl the cat to lie on a table during a key scene. Because the principal pussycat has already had a full day under the lights, Bill calls on one of Panther's protégés. As the scene starts, Kyle is talking to his mother, and he picks the cat up, and he'll typically try to set it into a direction that I'm at. The biggest challenge to me, once the cat is, has been taken out of the scene, is to try to keep the cat quiet so as to not to distract the actors as they continue on with the scene. So while Panther takes five, the best backup in the business sheds his stuff for the series star. Uh, could you see all that cat hair falling off of me? Go. For TV productions, working with domesticated creatures has its limitations. 